What are you doing? Thinking, John. I'm thinking. <clears throat> I can't believe Gloria punished my dad because I'm not training hard enough. You gotta remember, you're not a professional MMA player. You're a beginner, and that's how we start you out. You're doing other things, Teresa. You're not just running around the truck yard. You're doing other things, too. Like I said, you got a lot of workouts at your work. It's not the point, John. It's not. I really love to train at the truck yard. I really do. I really do. That truck yard would make my strength go up in everything. That is big hard work what they do. Good. Maybe I can... What do you want, Gloria? Well, I see you're up in Adam. I hear that you punished my dad because I'm not training hard enough. <clears throat> That's right. You are not training hard enough. Running around the truck yard is not working hard enough. I do other things, too, over there. Stop playing around, Gloria. You've got your own gym. You've got your own training spot. You don't need to spy on me. Really? Well, I got to know the moves from you. That's why. No, you don't. Because right now you're cheating again. I got other places that I can train at without your interference. I mean, a lot more places than you think, Gloria. And you don't need to spy on me. You've got your own training spot. Why don't you just leave me alone so I can train? Because I can't train when you're spying on me like that. <sighs> Teresa, Teresa, Teresa. Gloria, Gloria, Gloria. You better lose that toot of yours. Maybe I don't want to right now because you really lit the fire on me, Teresa.
John, why don't you just go in the other room? This is me and Teresa's conversation. I don't want him to leave the room. I want him to stay here. So we're going to do some business now then. You want a table, ladder, ladder, chair, and table match in the ring. That's right. I do. But here's another deal from you. Since you're making deals from me, I'm going to make a deal for you. No weapons at all. Well, I'm going to have to find a way to kill you then. Yeah, you do that. I'm going to have to make another plan to kill you so I can put you on the top and throw you down at the audience. Is that your plan? I don't think you're going to kill me as easy as you killed those other girls either. I'm not going to be like those other girls. Because like I said, I do not like cheaters. So what did you do to my dad anyway? Same I did to Jermaine. Don't raise your eyebrows at me. Because I am... Furious with you. So John did tell you about your dad. That's great. Cause I love when they I love when they see you angry. Yeah, so you can punish my dad even more. Maybe. Like I said, your dad's so cute, too. I might keep him, too. You better not. I need my dad. Just because you didn't have a dad don't mean you can keep mine. It just makes you more angry. And I love it. You don't need my dad. He's my, he's your collateral. He's my collateral. That's what it is. That's why I grabbed him. And chained him up to another room. You mean he's not with Jermaine? No. I separated those two. They're talking too much. I can't sleep. So I moved him to another spare bedroom. So you're using the house. Maybe. You could be in a building. It doesn't matter. Because <clears throat> I don't want them planning on getting out. And as for you, John, I put something on Jermaine's handcuffs so he won't get out either. better let them go no because if you keep asking me to let them go I'm going to punish them even more <clears throat> so he's handcuffed and you chained my dad to a wall
very good. Is there anything else you could think of? My dad needs a bed now. He's not getting one. And I'm going to make sure of it. Jermaine's got the last bed. You told... You put Isaiah on... You put Isaiah on a bed. Oh, you went to go visit Isaiah again. Wow. Isaiah told me that you put him on a wall. Put him on a bed. Why can't he use the same bed that Isaiah used? <clears throat> because he don't belong on a bed. But since I punished him, I might get a cardboard put on to put him on. You better have warm blankets when the winter comes. It might be over by then. Like you said, Teresa, I'll see you in four months. Yeah, quit spying on me. So I can get my training in. I'm out.